guys, it's a funny lighting, I know. I'm in the lift and I'm actually gonna go run to work to pick up my second bike. It's been in repairs, but unfortunately still the wheels squeal. But we still love it, we still think it's amazing. I am about to walk out here. So I'm gonna run to work, it's about 5Ks, pick up a bike and bring it home. It's, it's pretty late. Check out this little walkway we have here. There's the pool that you always see when I film from the top. It's actually a pretty, pretty cool apartment building to live in. Been living here for almost three years now. We have a little gym here as well that I sometimes work out at when it's raining and I want to do stuff at this gym, but I also have membership at another gym and also do a lot of stuff outside, as you know. And in my bag, well, you can't really see it now. I'll show you at the traffic lights. We also have like loads of construction here. As you can see, there's like cranes, there's lots of steps. This is actually a really nice area. I should show you in the daytime. It's very pretty over here. So I'm out on the street now. I'm gonna grab my camel backpack, just a little one. I have my lights, my front and back light, the small ones with me. And I also have my key card to work, house keys, glasses. That's all I need for a good quick run. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna like film the actual run just so you don't get too frustrated with the, you know, jiggling of the camera because I'm not running with the, steady cam thing today but we'll have to go for a run with the steady cam at some point and let's get it done this area over here is really really nice and very beautiful the regatta is just behind me there's the bikeway and there's like over there is the city I will say I will have to bring you here when I get my proper vlogging camera so you can actually see all this place in the lights in the dark time but we're very very nice colors and better <laughs> and better views anyway I better start running and I'll see you when I get to work hey guys so I'm just coming up to traffic lights this is Brisbane Casino in red the middle of Brisbane it's just like behind me over there but there are buses a really really cool thing that we do here in Brisbane is light and dancing on Friday night and I have done it a few times and I love light and dancing it's just uh, I guess today I'm not doing it picking up the bike and gonna work on vlogs <laughs> half marathon shirt I rode I ran you can see in 2012 did a half marathon in Wellington it was my very first half marathon and very first like a longer distance ride so actually I'm very excited and very keen to repeat that oh yeah by the way my office you can't go in the basement to pick out your stuff after hours unless you have a little bigger thing but I suppose it's good it means things are safe let's get go get my baby one of my most favorite things after exercise is being able to hear your heartbeat. Your heartbeat like up in your head and like the blood is just like pulsing through. And like I love it and I love just completely dripping in sweat. <laughs> and like almost like, you know, the salty sweat getting into your eyes and it's just like, it's such an amazing feeling because you made yourself feel that way through doing something that is super duper good for you. Anyway, there's a baby, there's a bike. I'm just gonna quickly log in. Um, there's a 
bike and also you <laughs> like laugh at me but I'm using the yellow city cycle helmet just because I didn't want to run with the helmet so I'm borrowing like the city's uh, helmets and there is like a drop-off session next to my house so where I live so I'm just gonna you know hang it up there it's gonna be good check out guys there's another narco on the on the handle next to my bike hanging out here but it's a flat bar one It's like a mountain, more like a mountain or a cross. Cross bike. Where's mine? Where's mine? Where's mine? A really cool thing about my bike is that there is um, the compass at the bo bottom of it. Like, it's one of my most favorite things about it. Also, I actually want to ask your advice to all of you who are like super duper experienced and knowledgeable about bikes. Something that I have noticed started to happen with my ties is they started to strip even if I'm not riding that much. Like for example, when I took this bike back from the mechanic, like it hasn't been ridden much right for the last three months, simply because it's been at the mechanic for that long. It's like stupidly annoying. Anyway, have a look. See like especially this one, it's like so bad. And I don't even know why, like it hasn't been ridden, it hasn't been anything. And this, this happened to like my old tires on the blue giant, but that's okay because like, you know, that was fairly worn out, I would say, but this bike, like literally, like these tires are very, very new. I don't understand why. So if you know, if you have knowledge or idea why this would happen, this annoying stripping and destroying of the tire would happen. Let me know. Let me know. The star that I learned comes from. Well, my cherry.